Yeah, yeah I cop. I was uh, like, man, it's like one of the characters we didn't see, and there he is. And Wonderful. he was uh, moving, grooving. I'm a, I'm a big fan. So this is our losers finals of Killer Instinct Hub. Winner will go on to play Sleep, who has obviously made it all the way to the grand finals. Super impressive performances all day. Uh, I mean, that winner finals was scary. Hey, it showed that Thompson I, is so close. I'm getting pretty nervous, man. Like, the amount of commitment that these players are putting into some of these matches is getting insane. And how crazy are you willing to get? I feel that I feel that Thompson is kind of playing the most stable of all yeah. the players we've kind of seen today. And sometimes it's not paying off. Like, sometimes yeah. in Killer Instinct, you're rewarded for getting a little nutty. Yeah, you got to take a risk, right? And that's the, the truth with any fighting game. Mm -hmm. If you play a little too honest, a little too cookie cutter, mm -hmm. people will figure you out, right? So that's a good thing to, to notice. Like, if you're like, this guy never takes a risk in his life, so I'm going to walk up to him and do whatever. Yeah, I'm going to start walking up throwing you. Yeah, exactly. And what are you going to do about it? So you got to take those risks. And I feel like Thompson has good management about when he takes risks. Uh, he is playing kind of a He turns it on sometimes, and it's, yeah. it's obvious when he turns it on. For sure. And so this is going to be another three out of five. Losers finals. Winner will go on to play sleep deep, deep in this Killer Instinct bracket that we've had all day long. Top 32 action. Both players looking ridiculously focused right now because a lot of money is on the line. Yeah, and it's just the pride, right? You want to do so well at this tournament. You want to prove that all that time and effort you put in is worth it. And this is the chance to do so. Combo miss, but still picks it up with a Rekka anyway. And then he's doing so well. At, you know, establishing those breaker games, establishing wow. them. Standing medium punch from Jago Kotisako on the dash in was just ready for it. Yeah, it's a very good button for sure. And Thompson's neutral game is, is I feel like, very underrated. Uh, he has some of the best ground control and just neutral button choices out of anybody. He is really a strong Shoto player that you have to be mindful of. Big jump overhead. And he's actually good about confirming that too. He sees whether it's blocked. He sees or not. whether or not it hits or lands. Yeah, there's a good amount of uh, hit stun that happens during so. Goes for the empty jump low. Oh, counter. Great yeah. catch from Storm. Yeah, you can't hit buttons on the way down there. She will be able to cancel that. Normally, we see Storm actually go for quite. Oh, another counter. He should have gone low. That would have been probably a better Storm option. Storm has ended the last two combos extremely quick. Normally, we're used to seeing him going for like up upwards of 40 to 50%. And so far, he is not going for that at all. Yeah, it seems like while in Instinct, he would rather take damage and go for uh, a different mix up. So. Yeah. Oh, another counter, man. He just knows. Done. That's going to do it. That potentially could put us into the next life bar. Shadow to, to close it out. It's going to yeah, do that just it. enough. Yeah, two bars spent. But, you know, instinct worth still the available resources. for Thompson. Yeah, always worth the resources to kill. Oh, yeah, Sweeping low under. profile. <laughs> oh, and caught him walking in. Yeah, Thompson didn't expect him to try to take up that space. Oh, wow, break. The late, that break was super late. Every combo break right now, every every counter that is going to be happening is extremely clutch. This is a $30,000 prize pool leading up to this. Activation has the projectiles out. It's going to be a lot of life back. Oh, fake the overhead. Wow, the that was counter. ridiculous looking. Oh, you got to be a genius. Man, that was some next level stuff. The meaty fireballs makes his approach. Storm with the anti-air. Medium doubles, no breaker. Goes for the in combo reset. Good but the big up for Thompson. He, he was just blocking low. The music's kicking in. Oh. He gets the reset. The potential damage. A lot it's of potential huge. damage. The next hit can win. Overhead. Oh, Ultra Mike. What an amazing sequence from Storm. Man. Like he was, he literally dragged Jago in combo to the opposite side of the screen and yeah. then did the wall bounce for the next setup. A genius. He brought him all the way over there and that air on Rio's on was perfect. He knew that he was in danger right into the Ultra. Clean, clean play from Storm. We've seen all day just be so impressive on that Isako. Opens up the round immediately with a with a with a big combo that's going to start this mix up, pushing Jago into the corner once again. Nice, nice guess on the medium break from Jago. Thompson so does careful. have he has an opportunity here to kind of reset the neutral because Storm is dashing in, hitting buttons, and getting rewarded for it. It's that big forward roundhouse. Checks him after. It is advantage on block, which you got to be so concerned about. Okay. Nice dash fireball up. dash cancel. Yeah. He's been making good use of that dash cancel. Ah, the empty throw. Went forward a second time. It is going to beat the counter, right? So that's why empty jump throw is a good idea from uh, Jago. Cotter, big activation. Can go for damage here. That's going to refill his instinct as well. Look at the damage output on that combo. Like, wow. Goes low. The trade combo. Oh, the, the counter hit stun. 
It's massive, yeah, it's so, so huge. Good call from Thompson. Knew he wanted to teleport in, so he was jumping back with heavy punch. It's gonna cover that almost on all ends. Yeah, very smart, right? Uh, I mean, if he, if he teleported in, he could try the counter, but maybe just not got it in time. It's a very similar situation to the first round. Storm is down by a little bit of health. If he lands one combo, he is going to bring this into the final life bar. Confirmed. But Thompson is, go is not going to allow that. And there it is. Medium kick, uh, manual into medium breaker. He did it twice in a row, and Storm broke on the second time. What? <laughs> what? Oh my, yeah, that, that deserved a counter on Wake Up for sure. Sometimes you're just the best in the world, and that, that was one of those moments. Oh, the delay. He waited so long and he got that timing lockout. That, that's, I'm still reeling back from that uppercut. Yeah, I would be too if I was Storm. That was a, that was a big one. Ooh, look for that fierce. Just a little out of range. Spacing with that, uh, that fireball from Jago. Baited the counter. He gets the throw. Empty low. Empty jump low. Goes for the reset. And just gets out of there. You see Thompson back to this neutral yeah, one. Thompson, so Thompson is ready for the counters now. So I don't think Storm has landed as nearly as many as he usually does. And there, there it one. is. Yeah, it was right on the jump in. Okay, ends the combo. Short combo. Storm, he does have that instinct available. We saw him bring this comeback last time. That was a big part of this. Comeback potential is massive. Oh, it actually hit. Cash out, and it's the corner. So close. Good block low. Oh, the oh, cancel. He thought he was yeah. going to go. You know what? That is so smart from Thompson because before he uppercutted through yes. the string, this time he threw a fireball because if he uppercutted, Sokka was going to catch the high. Exactly. That was ridiculously smart. Yeah, very smart. It's it's that mind game, right? You can't counter those projectiles. So very, very, very smart. <laughs> oh, oh, no, he didn't. He said he was going for uppercut. Like, <laughs> he said that wasn't supposed to be a fireball. I love it. And I he said, nope, nope, definitely I love it wasn't. how Storm is like, there is no way you were thinking three Dang, levels he deep He stood on that up one. in the middle of Loser's Finals to ask him. He's like, He's Look, like, you, that was not a fireball, man. Can, Tell you just me break it it. can you just break it down for me? <laughs> Those, com those commentators said you're really I was smart. giving him the credit, You too. were giving him the credit. I thought he that that was knew. a read. Yeah, he How knew. did he know? Genius. Genius. <laughs> like I thought, I thought that, that he had that read. Up. He was like, hey, he's going to parry, so I'll throw a fireball. Like, I was like, that Max, was shut up. He, he, that was supposed to be an uppercut. Come on. All right, here we go. Yeah, I mean, if you're a real top player, you just don't admit it. You're like, oh, definitely it was a fireball. Yeah, was yeah like, you just look a little shifty-eyed and say, yes. I was actually inputting taunt. You got really lucky that didn't come out. <laughs> so we're tied one to one right now. This is losers finals. Neutral jump, and you see him he didn't go for the parry, but also didn't go for a jump button. He was so scared of that interaction. A lot more fireball from Thompson at the start. There's no bar from Hisako to make it through, right? Her shadow move goes through the projectile. What a pickup! The best she can do is potentially dash under forward, right? Which is good, but uh, not not quite the same as having a shadow move that goes half screen. On rails on, good block, and baited the counter again. Thompson yeah, very aware. It, it feels like Thompson is getting a little, a little aware of when these things are going to be coming out. Those counters are unsafe as hell. Yeah, on whip, super bad. Jump away. And now Stormy's trying to approach. Got the instinct. Land sweep. Almost any went for the counter again. I feel like Thompson is so aware now. He's too prepared, and that should be the life bar. Building himself some instinct with yeah, you around the world. and he gets the opportunity to build two big portions of his instinct. Man, this is looking good for Thompson. Ooh. Oh, late cancel. Yeah, he saw. He waited a long time after that fierce Space the fireball. Okay. Counter hit, nothing from Storm. Pick up out of the air. A little bit of damage. Two major, and now Thompson moving in. The air to air, but oh. it ended up turning into a jump in. Huge. Chance he's got two bars. This is so good for Thompson right now. He's been controlling this match. And I think that was brilliant to go for the damage instead of just going for the uh, healing, right? Just take that big lead you have and, and work on it and improve it. Heavy oh, break. Oh, break on the heavy. Very late. Yeah, those delay doubles, you can see them and react to them, and that's exactly what Thompson did. I feel like Storm needs to start, maybe start changing his play style a little bit because this has not been working out for the past two games. 100%. And I, this fireball range is so smart, right? And you can see that Thompson's really playing it slow now. He's baiting those counters that he's going for. Oh, miss input? And a counter breaker. That of course, of course, of course. Huge course. statement from Thompson to end this game. Going up 2 to 1 in losers' finals. Whoever wins this next game, or potentially if Thompson wins this next game, is going to grand finals. Yeah, and I mean, the, the one important thing that you have to note, right, is that the first game that Storm won was through a massive comeback. Yeah. And since then, Thompson has looked completely.
completely clean, right? He's had a big lead. Even in the game he lost, he had a big lead, and it was a comeback that, that you know, ended up getting Storm the win. So it's it's really impressive that he has managed basically three games in a row to be ahead by so much. Storm not probably, not probably going to switch characters, just taking a quick breather because uh, a lot of pressure on the line here. These guys have been through hell and high water and a whole bunch of character variety leading up into this point. Yeah, it has been over 12 hours since the start of the tournament. Yep. So these guys have been playing all day, trying to stay focused and compete at a super high level. And just just in terms of high level competition in Killer Instinct, you have to know not only the matchups, you have to know what every button looks like of every character in Killer Instinct. That's one of the that's one of the things you really have to give credit to top players is that matchup knowledge in KI right. takes a long time. It's there yeah, it's such a huge barrier, right? You gotta figure out their combos, their you know, individual combo their systems. Their manuals, what they usually do. Right, all that. And that's even before you and just that's look just at the character. character. That's yeah. just the character. And then you gotta take the player into consideration. Right, yeah. That's just the base stuff that you gotta consider after that. Ooh, a little low check, Thompson, short combo. And the uh, reset, double re triple wow. reset. Wow, Thompson with a huge amount of confidence going for that. I mean look at the damage he already built up, right? Fifty percent. Just some raw hits. He didn't even really end the combo. Yeah, he went for a couple of the, the resets. He got the dash cancels going, and, and really, that's when the mix-ups start to flow with Jago. Chasing things out. And the anti air is good. Heavy uh, at the end of that Not to get the sure juggle. Not she was going. I mean, maybe he missed it, but this is such a good spot now. Oh, the oh, bait. Oh, man. It's not working out for Storm in oh, terms of in. those counters. It's a big chance now for Storm. Thompson Medium had that combo break. drop. Okay, huge now. Is Storm gonna go for a longer combo or a shorter one? He's actually extended it quite a bit. Wall jump out of there and doesn't meaty. Oh, oh, super far away. Sneaking in. Very smart. So it's gonna be good damage for him now. He can meaty if he'd like, but he shoot. Yeah, it's nice and slow. Don't overcommit if you don't have to. Activation. Oh, is he gonna be able to catch him? Shadow counter right oh, away, but the counter. Oh, that no, was, yeah, nothing to do. That was really smart from Thompson just to sit there for a moment. Gonna be able to build up some of that bar, spend it, two in a row, and uh, man, he's got a lot of that health back already. So you gotta be so uh, worried about it as Isako, right? Good teleport, but... Nice oh, back catch from Thompson just to get out of there. Thompson playing nice and slow. You see this, not over committal. Playing that, that classic Shoto style, right? Yeah, this is some of the most, uh, I'd say, some of the most like neutral focused kind of patient play we've seen in this entire tournament going happening sure. right now. And it's because there is a lot on the line. Oh, we missed the uppercut. Good catch. Oh, goes to another uppercut. That should take him out. Yes, it does. Here we go. We're just about even here. You now in terms of instinct and bar and health. Storm landing the first big hit of this life bar. Will they go for a longer combo or a shorter one? Oh, it does go for the oh, counter breaker. The counter Overhead too, man. On the lockout, he has another bar. That's a big lockout. Are we going to see... Wow, this is going to be a lot of damage, man. 62. 62% Jago, excuse me. Oh, uppercut play. Does he counter tag? He doesn't want to go for it. Big chance now for Storm oh. with the break. Down medium punch. Pressure. Caught he on got the back him. dash. Three in a row. Reset. Counter hit combos. He can bring it back. Uh oh. Okay. Wait, one chance. He, he has full wrath. He can do one chance. Right into. Oh, That's yeah. it. He got him. Wow. Storm brings it back on that. He's done this several times where he's down by a huge deficit, and then he has one good run, a couple of resets, and yes. then bam, that's that's a victory. Yeah, and I mean, it's those clutch moments, right? He's playing so, so well in the clutch. It's very tough to do, especially with a character, who, you know, like a grappler and like a, a counter-based character yeah. in these clutch moments. Knowing when and when not to use those tools is so scary. Yeah, just like that. Man. The break. Thompson's yeah. breaks. His timing is so perfect. Last time that, that happened, Storm tried a counter breaker and he didn't take the bait. Forcing Storm to go for the shorter combo. I'm, I've noticed that the longer Storm attempts to get combo damage, the more successful he usually is. For sure. I feel like the more he extends the combo, uh, the better it's it works the, out. It, you make it more risky usually, but it's just been working out in Hisako's favor. Yeah, for sure. Her combos are, are naturally sort of tough to break. Confirmed wow, from downtown. great confirmation. Also an equally great break. Yeah, and a little check with the wing kick after. Does he break? No, oh, he oh, does it man, again. that's so risky. He just knows. I, he just always is, like he's just always in his head. Ooh, wake up, down, medium kick cuts are so low to the ground. And sends it pretty yeah. good. Combo extension, as you mentioned, so important. Who's gonna be the first to pop instinct? It's Jago. Big jump. It was an end. Oh, oh, he put the button right in the end. And the oh, wake up. Oh, he went for a throw. grab. 
So yeah, Jago tried to grab, but the command from Hisaka will avoid the grab. Yeah, his reads are crazy right now on all these different scenarios. This is ridiculously close. Just just to let you all know, this is who goes into grand finals. And Storm is doing the first damage to oh, Jago's second line bar. Chip. Wait, he's, he's can't panic for the chip. You cannot panic for the chip if you if you try to get a little too impatient. Yeah, this the the struggle to take off that life bar. Yeah. Okay. Got okay. It, got, got, it, got, it. It. got it. Okay. 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 Thompson's still down about 25%, trying to build his instinct as much yes. as possible, but Storm looking pretty good. They both have full meter, which means ridiculous damage at any touch. Oh, the dash got right into the fireball, and the sweep is good. <gasps> Big jump! Oh but my she's god, so I can't little. believe that whiffed. Raw overhead. The linker. No, no breaks. breaks from Storm. He's so scared. We're all scared. No shadow counter, oh, but the counter. The clutch grab. Oh, dude, that. Oh, the my breaker. God. Yeah, he's <laughs> just taking the risk. I can't even. Walk under and the punish. Activation. Here comes a lot of life back for Jago. Oh, and it was a lockout. Jump over. But the back throw. This is he's going to convert this. It's a short, short combo. Short, short. Oh, hit him. Oh. Oh. Does he break? Oh, my oh, God. How? Again. <laughs> And you know Storm's got to be so scared okay, okay. about it. This is getting this is getting extremely close. In danger now. Sako has wrath. Next hit will do it. Next hit. Oh! oh! Cancels it to make it safe. The jump back. Can he chase? Oh! And Sierra, but it missed. It missed. It missed the cancel. The no! Oh, God! Oh, he missed oh, it. It I whipped under her. She was so small. The hurt box is so little. Goes for the sweep. One hit. Oh, oh my God! God! Storm got him with the command grab and is going into grand finals. The punish on the neutral jump Holy. from so far. I was wondering what was going to be the answer. What was the awareness that he had? And what a Dude, genius, some genius of these, Some of these decision. top four matches have been ridiculously close, man. Super duper worrisome set for sure. And uh, Storm did it. He made it all the way through. Yeah. After a really crazy run into the top eight anyway. Uh, he makes it all the way here. And man, this guy has got to be feeling real good about that. I mean, the that... only person he's lost to is about his sleep, who yeah. he's about to play in grand finals. That's true. And I'm. And it's crazy the top eight just leading up into grand finals, which is going.